Um, this is Dark Side Detective. The Dark Side Detective. Yeah, we played this, I think, yeah, like it's a few weeks ago, a few streams ago. Um, it's a point and click adventure where you're an occult detective and you go in cases and it's pretty, um, pretty easy going or, you know, comedic, lighthearted, maybe. Even though it doesn't deal, it could deal with things that are less, um, could be spooky. Um, yeah, last time we, um, solved a case of some ghosts at a library. And the time before, we found a missing girl who was stuck in a pocket dimension. Um, yeah. So now we're on to case three, Disoriented disorient express so here we go uh case summary Dooley has called me to the subway station to deal with an emergency start investigating oh there we go got click on these things you got a point and you gotta click it's 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 what the, what's it's what you gotta do there's officer Dooley he's our uh, partner he helps us out. He's not the brightest, but he does his best sometimes. Detective, you're here. And I don't remember voices. Uh, I came as soon as you called. What's the case? Case? No, I just needed a ride. Station's closed. Closed? Yeah, some spooky train is blocking the platform. Anyway, let's go. A spooky train? Yep, spooky train. Anyway, we better get going or we'll be late for work. <laughs> he doesn't care. He doesn't care about spooky trains. Dooley, it's a spooky train. We're the dark side d division. <laughs> do you not think? I try not to. That's detective's work. Ah, uh, ma ma. Ma ma ma. Let's go have a look then. Fine. If we miss the free donuts at work, you're buying. Oh, that's... Maybe we should just go back to work. Are you sure we can't just jump? We can't just go to work? <laughs> I need my morning nap in. He makes a good point. Stop that. Quit it. Quit it. Ah, my spleen. Oh no. Everyone. If you have an anatomy class tomorrow, apparently your spleen is somewhere on your upper thigh to hand to coat. This general area is your spleen. Yep, take notes everyone. Very important. Spleen, right here, right here. Spleen. Okay, let's, let's go, let's talk to Dooley. Let's get on with this waste of time. Nothing happening here. Investigation, then. Uh, okay. Station sign. I can't say I'm surprised to find that something strange is happening here. Oh. <laughs> 66 6th Street. I see what's going on. Uh, oh, look at that. Cops is dumb. Not as dumb as your grammar, kid. Yeah. Detective McQueen is just... He's just good. He's on the case. Yeah, kid. <gasps> did, did you do it? Um... Seems to be working. But I have no cash. Time to put this badge to work. And make use of my police privileges. Oh. Interesting. Um, hey, Dooley. Uh, do you use the subway often? No, before we had the squad car, I tended to take taxis. <laughs> oh, snob. What? What? Did you say something just then? What? Me? No, 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 no. I'm gonna raise the volume of the volume. There's a lot of ambient music going on. Can we go back upstairs? No, we're gonna go. We're gonna jump the barrier. 
story, detective. The barrier is broken. We have to crawl under it. Uh, can we at least jump over? No, the insurance for jumping was too high. We're only cleared for a slow crawl. Uh, being a cop is nothing like television promised. It would be... Conductor. Oh, he looks to be a ghost. <gasps> Busker. Hey, Busker. What do you have to say? See, it's just spooky. Uh, generically spooky. Nothing special about it. Let's go get a donut. Let's go get donuts. I can read. It's been a while. Uh, Dooley is glowing. Uh, maybe it's pregnant. That could be. You retrain. There's something about this green, transparent, and eerie train that suggests it's not meant to be here. Uh, Mr. Busker. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna have to hydrate. Oscar the Grouch. Okay. Unky Sam, don't want to, you to know about the truths from here to show. So it makes me frown when I smell a pig and his dumb sidekick come to shut me down. Sidekick isn't a word. Political. Sorry, poetic license, not political license. Pig. Wow, is he gonna say, oh, he's just gonna say the same thing. Wait, like, can we, like, arrest you? Um, hello, conductor. Do you have a ticket, sir? Uh, who are you? Train conductor, sir. Right, you look a tad ghostly, sir. That I do, that I do. Are you a ghost? Not at all, sir. Ghosts are blue, and f for one, and they can't be seen. Not without proper equipment. No, we're from the dark side. Uh, then what are you doing here? Train stuck, sir. Doing my job to keep the passengers safe while this gets rectified. Uh, rectified? Yes, sir. I'm sure those boys from the Bright Side Division are looking into it right now. Bright Side? Is that where we live? Uh, Bright Side Division? Bright Side Division. Right. We're in the Dark Side Division. It's very spooky. It's very spooky, Nanners. Don't worry, he's not a ghost. He's just from a parallel world. It, it's, it's perfectly fine. Why are you here? As I said, sir, train stuck. Not sure what caused it. Likely a problem with the tracks, sir. We'd have to see inside the control rooms to be sure. I can't leave my post here. Uh, ticket. Thought not, I'm afraid. I have to ask you solids to leave. But it's a subway. If we. You don't need tickets to ride the subway. Well, you do, but they get dealt with earlier. <laughs> Did you just call us solids? That's racist, sir. Or prejudice, at least. Certainly not, sirs. I wouldn't be throwing around language like that. Uh, goodbye. Come back anytime, sir. Uh... Okay. I like your banjo. Okay, we got janitor cart. Plunger, but without the plungy bit. Uh, so a stick then? Okay, we got we got a stick. Two more, two more of these. I can have a juggling act. Yeah, mediocre ju juggling act. Can we hit? No, we can't hit Dooley. We'll hit the security camera. I wonder if this camera caught any useful footage. I can see from the working light. Sorry. <laughs> but I can see that the working light is painted on. Oh. Whoopsie doodles. 
Control room, bin. Hmm, there seems to be something in here. We got a receipt. A glowing green receipt that says for pickup. Can't read much else on it. Oh. Interesting. Can you read it, sir? No. Ooh, toilets. Well, control room is locked. For now. Dooley. Oh, come on, detective. We all know as well as I do how these things go. You know as well as I do how these things go. I can read. Just I choose not to sometimes. No, we can't break in there. Go to the bathroom. Oh, there's poop. Oh, it's a rat. Hmm. I need to get my eyes, but eyebrows plucked. Eh, flickering light. It wouldn't be a, a dodgy underground bathroom without a flickering light. That's true. It also wouldn't be a secret rave venue. Huh? What was that? Nothing, detective. Ooh. Cubicle? Is that what they're called? Oh, 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 oh. Sorry. Uh, this is against... This is probably against Twitch Terms of Service. I apologize. We got a ghost poop. We got ghost poop, everybody. He's got no toilet paper. Oh, that's so sad. I'm a bit of a bind, daddy-o. It's Shaq. It's Shaq. Hey, Shaq. You doing a Shaq attack? That's what he calls pooping. Uh, hi there. Oh, oh, sorry. The door was unlocked. Yeah, locks broke. I've now I have no feet to hold against it. Right. Well, uh, we'll leave you to it. Oh, hold up, Daddy O. I'm in a bit of a funky situation. Maybe you could help me out. Oh, uh, what is it? Stars got has no toilet paper, Daddy O. And I'm a cat that needs some. Needs needs him some. There we go. Yeah, um, sure we can look. Can we here use this? Is this yours? Oh. No, but I found it in my pocket. Threw it in the bin on the way here. Would ya? Would have kept it if I knew the paper sticking in here. Sitchin? Sitchin. Sitchin. Situation. How oh, this? No. Well, I'm glad he didn't keep the paper. Um, what's this rat? Oh. Bye. Oh. That can't be good. This is why you always look before you sit. Uh, <laughs> what on earth is that? Uh, not sure, but I think we should send it back to wherever it came from. Flush. No use. Oh, you could say that <laughs> intent. <laughs> Sorry. That it is intentical on staying where it is. Oh my gosh. A a a. Like I wrote this game. <laughs> I need something to find to push it down with. We have we have a plunger handle, but we don't have a plunger. Uh, graffiti. That's some lazy graffiti. Oh, he's putting more effort when tagging in, tagging the subways. What? You heard me, Nark. Wow. Okay, let's go. No, he keeps on going. He keeps on coming back. So that's telling me that maybe we have to do something with him. Um, flickering light. They haven't made any notes yet. No, oh, that's not. That's not. No, no, that's not how you do make notes. Apparently. Okay, nothing going. Oh, we got toilet paper. Creepy or not, nobody deserves to be stranded without toilet paper. Yay! Flush. You're just flushing. Why did you come in with us, Dooley? 
That m noise reminds me of my career since I was assigned to the Dark Side Division. Wow. We put. No, oh, no. Can I put it on this handle? No. Uh, cheap sandpaper cleverly disguises toilet paper. Nice. Alright. Sir. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. There you go. Here you go, guy. Sorry to leave you hovering for so long. Far out, daddy -o. Here, take this coin as thanks. We got an occult coin. Yay. An evil looking coin about the size of a quarter. Yeah, the dark side's supposed to be evil, right? Can we talk to you? Oh. I'm grateful for your help, daddy -o. But do you intend to stick around for the main show? I, I guess not. I just assumed he already did this pooping. Uh, nope. Alright, let's go, maybe? Um. Oh, let's give this guy a coin. Hey, that ain't no real money. Oh. Wow. Sorry, sir, but passengers... Passage to this train cannot be bought. Well, I mean to say it can be, just not from me. Oh. Can we buy a ticket now? Oh. Right. Oh, right, of course. We got a ticket. We did it. Here we go, one ticket. Fine, on you go then, I suppose. This looks like a good thing to do. Uh, what do we got? Tracks, the platform. We got some ghosts, we got party guy. I like your glasses. Da, they have my party goggles. On your way to a party? Always, Doc, darling. Every place is a party place when you have my goggles on, and I always have my goggles on. Aw, Anton, that's a good attitude. Even here now, we party on the train. I remember in Toronto, there was like a, a there was a bus that was like super late that would go from one, like, across the city, and it was like a wasn't so much a party bus, more like the end of the party bus. It, it, it had a lot of hardiness to it. <gasps> Hippie girl! Gal, sorry. Well, hello there. Oh, Officer Dooley. Hiya! Where are you off to? I'm on my way to San Francisco, Cisco, obviously. And then we got stuck here. This place is terrifying. How so? Over starts, there's not a single screaming beast in the sky. And no one is being followed by shadow men. Nothing's on fire. Nothing. Oh, uh, maybe you're not the girl for me. Oh, that's too bad, Officer Dooley. Everyone here is so sick looking. They're not sick, they're transparent. I can see right through them. I've always been impressed with your scrutiny skills. Okay. Hey, Granny. Yeah, I guess the dark side is supposed to be pretty horrific. I guess it, it, it's, it's not a pleasant place. But some people call it home. And sometimes you just gotta make the best of your home. Uh... Nanny Doodle? Dooley, is that you? Sorry, dearie. I'm Granny Gooley. You do look like my little Patrick, though. Uh, my name's Patrick, too. Did you also like games of I Spy as a child? I did. I Spy with my little eye, the coming of the end, the world eating itself, 
Rivers of gore flooding the streets. Uh, I, I, I don't know this version of the game. Oh, seeing the end times was little Patrick's favorite. Oh, interesting. Is there anything we can grab? I guess we'll go to the tracks. Oh, that can't be good. Ah, dark side portal. Here's we found our number one suspect for all these strange goings on. <laughs> you have the right to remain silent when questioned. Anything you say or do may be. Uh, Dooley, what are you doing? Reading its rights. And how do you exactly. How exactly do you intend to arrest it? Uh, with my handcuffs, obviously. Uh, Tark top marks for enthusiasm, Dooley. Um, I guess we're just gonna walk in there? Okay. That seemed like a bad idea. Oh, there's more trade. Uh, looks like the purple rift has an accomplice. I'm gonna need a second pair of handcuffs. Eh. Ancient McScream. <gasps> it's our dark side equivalent. That's awesome. Uh, you look familiar. It's got hair here, but no hair up there. You have like reverse hair. Uh, does the fire recognize the flame? Does the darkness recognize the shadow? Does the storm recognize the the wind? Rain? Damn it, man. I lost my train of thought. Uh, so you're an agent here? We're all agents of the never-ending hunt. Servants of the crawling dead void. <laughs> Ministers of the world's cruelty. Well, I'm happy you're doing okay for yourself. Thanks. It's been a lot of hard work and late nights at the office. Uh huh. Uh, any idea? Any idea what's going on? Interlopers, fiends, fleshy monstrosities—things that should not have come to pass. Tracks of chaos intertwine. Um. So, not much of an idea right now. No. Uh. So, receding airline. How's that treating you? Wow, that's rude. The end comes for us all. Entropy is a cruel mistress. Yeah, uh, let's hope it's from growing up in this weird hole. Uh, goodbye? I best be going. We all had all best be going to the places we would be best be at. Uh, yeah. Is this yours? No, thank you. I've already eaten. Wow. I guess we're gonna go in this train, this human train. Hey, Roxa. Finally, some... somebody in authority. Hey. Sorry, guy, but you don't know any more than the rest of us. Hi, detective. What's going on? Raxa, what are you doing here? Sir, why are you here? Who's Raxa? Getting the train from college? Then we got diverted to wherever this is. Well, we're on the case now, so get comfortable. Eh. He means... No, yeah, I get it. Let me know if I can be help at all. Will do. Uh... Any updates, detective? Still investigating, Raxa. Okay. Fire extinguisher. Face the fires, pray someone has refilled the extinguisher. They have not. See, these people look healthy. Healthier. That's because be that's because they're alive, Dooley. Playing video games, listening to music, indulging in mind-altering substances. 
I guess they are living life to the fullest. Wow. Headphones. Hello? Do daddy. Wonder if he even knows what's going on. Uh, hey, conductor. Stay back, monster. Calm down. Sorry, I thought you were him. Him? The intense man in the tunnels who threatens to arrest and or eat anyone who gets off the train. Mm, arrest or eat? Yep. I'm not sure who chooses. What's going on here? You're not... You're really not him. I don't really know what's happened. We left the last station on time, then some weird light flashed, and now we're here. Wherever here is. Don't need ghosts. Uh, who's this man you keep talking about? We, we, we know who he is. He, 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 he looks a bit like you. Only not. Not at all. Now that I see you, properly see you, we have like the same coat. He sucks about outside this train, sniffing for clues and snarling when he sees us. Hmm. Has he hurt anyone so far? Thankfully, no. He seems more menacing than dangerous. Alright. Bye. <laughs> if you see yourself in a parallel dimension, please stay in the carriage. An oddly useful warning. Hey, Tommy. Hey, dude. We've been on this train for ages. What's going on? I'm afraid. Because I keep on seeing floating green people. I'm not at liber... Hey. I think I indulged a little too much this morning. <laughs> you shouldn't tell him. Probably shouldn't be telling that. Telling me that. I'm an officer of the law. Far out, dude. Never mind. Oh, he's, he's, he's just a little stone. That's okay. Uh, I guess we'll go to... Oh. I should probably stay with these people. Make sure they're okay. <laughs> You're tired from walking through the tunnels, aren't you? Stop using your Sherlock powers on me. Okay, we're on our own now. Ooh. Oh, I used my coin up. Hello, ghost cop. Chief Ghoulie, he's a chief in the other world. Now then, now then, now then, you look like one of those living folks we've been plodding about the, that uh, we've got plodding about the place right now. Uh, Officer Dooley? Name's Ghoulie, chief of the Brightside Division. Uh, Brightside? Division, specialist, deals with the threats from your neck of the woods. So, as to speak, uh, my neck of the woods, the other world, at uh, which from mm, whence you came, son, I surmise from your appearance that you are a detective. I bet one down is. <laughs> I beat one down on his look. Hey, I presume that being the case. You've crossed over to investigate your world's version of this situation. I am. Can you help me? No, son, I cannot. This isn't your jurisdiction. You should leave this to us professionals and take care of our train... Uh, back... Sorry. And take care of our train back in your own world. Um, shouldn't you look into that? Jurisdiction, son. Seems like a concept beyond a dangerous maverick such as yourself. Maybe I should slap you behind bars. Wow. He's so mean. Uh, hey, busker. Sing me a song, buddy. What? You're the busker, not me. That's how buskers work here, you tourists. Uh... Is this yours? Those look like lyrics to a song I once wrote. Ah! Uh, beautiful. Brings a tear to the eye. 
What with the memories it stirs of my childhood spent playing cops and convicts on the Isle of Screaming Tar. Oh. Okay. But we didn't actually lose that. That's good. Can we... We can go on the platform, right? This is a restricted area, classified personnel only. Are you classified personnel? No, not think so. All on account of myself and Mick Scream being the only ones who, who is. But unless you is one of us, I suggest you step back, son. Step back. Okay, let's just go upstairs. <laughs> is this machine crying? Um, this seems like a bad idea. Come and get me from the station, he said. Routine, he said. Ass. Burning barrel. Help me, I'm on fire! What the earth? Ah, I'm burning trash barrel. I meant to be on fire, you gong. The look on your face, brilliant. Oh, Boris. I'm not even... Stations. Trains do not run on time, they run on fuel. Train will also be late. Some things are universal, I suppose. Debris. Uh, most of the dark side city appears to be in ruins. Costume shop. Oh! Given how little they know about this place. I know about this place. Sorry. Given how little I know how this place works, they could sell costumes or turn you into one. But horrors could possibly make the news of here. <laughs> Mayor points off camera. Wow. Can we get a uh, an outfit? Amaze your friends, surprise your enemies, confuse real pirates with this inefficient pirate ensemble. Comes with free press ganging. That be a badass biker. Bike not included. Are you still a biker without a, a bike? Be a badass walker. Assuming your ass is bad, either in a dangerous sense or missing a buttocks way, your call. Hmm. Did you write these advert adverts yourself? No, sir. Came that way, sir. Good words, ain't they, sir? A wizard. A snarky teenage wizard is welcome anywhere. Well, not so much welcome as he'll turn up and then he'll be there. It's almost as much hassle to get rid of him as just to leave him be. Hmm. That's my usually part that's my usual party vibe anyway. The two thumbs up for me. Punk wig. Dressed like a punk. Or Road Warrior from the future. Or uh, you could wear them and be, uh, I don't know, a carrot? I'm convinced. Full of ones and zeros. Oh, would anyone wear these? Say, sir. While well, wearing a brown bin bag. Come on, guy. This is a nice coat. And they say the customer is always right. Okay. Uh, if you look like this man, this might be a mirror. Also, you may be wanted by the police for questioning. Interesting. What am I doing? Ooh, wig and mustache. What's this one? Looks normal enough to me. Normal, sir. Why, that's very pillar summer. Sorry. That's the very pillar summers are built on, sir. A friend and mentor of those in need. A shoulder to cry on. A person who will live in a wood hut with no air conditioning. The legendary camp counselor, sir. Uh, no one would buy that as a camp, camp counselor. Oh, but they do, sir. It's the mustache, sir. Shows them to be rugged, 
Wilder Wilderman suited for rough and tumble life of, of a camp counselor. Not for the timid folks like you and I. No, uh, I sir. No sir. Not for shop vendor and coat warmer. No. Uh. Invisible person. Welcome, sir. It's our. That is to say, me and eyes. Pleasure to welcome you to the costume costume shop. So, that is your name? Your broken sign wasn't very clear. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. My old fella said, if it is broken, maybe don't fix it anyway. He added, very practical man he was. How can I aid you, sir? Trying to intimidate your direct supervisor at work? Hoping to wow a six-armed lover? Try tired of looking like a hobo? Hey. That's our motto. Whatever your shame, spiders got you covered. <laughs> okay. Can I just can I buy stuff? Sir, I asked you might nicely not but once. Keep your sausage fingers from my money box. Uh receipt. Uh one tick, sir. Oh, Miss Miss Biscotti, I doesn't, I does beg your pardon, Miss. I should have known. Obviously, to me, now it is. He's very hard to read. I'll get your items for you now, Miss. Uh, yes, thanks. Then here you go, Miss. One swim cap. Uh, thanks, I guess. Oh, come on. Anything else? Blah, blah, blah. He's saying the same thing. Can I buy anything? No. Hmm. I want the, the mustache. Poster. Uh, no. Okay, we have a, a bald cap. Subway stairs. All right. Ooh, mold. Dark patch of fuzzy mold. I think that's looking at me. Oh, we got fuzzy mold. <gasps> it's a beard. I need something to complete the disguise before putting on. Wait. Oh, now I guess I can dress up as Agent McScream. Whatever I want, whenever I want. Yay! Okay. We'll go downstairs. We'll get dressed in front of him. Time to try this. I can't bring myself to call it a disguise. Time to try whatever this is out. Uh, I guess. There we go. We did it. Hello, sir. We're just going to... Hello. Do you think, son, that I've not seen my share of disguises? This one is particularly poor. What with it? Partially made up of some fungus. And you lacking a certain floaty, transparent quality. Oh. It was worth a shot. It was. I wish that agent I sorry, I wish that agent I was sent was so innovative. I'll tell you what, son. In you go. Maybe you can solve this thing after all. What about jurisdiction? Oh, paperwork up a solution. Now uh before I change your mind. Right, thanks. Dark side people are hard to read because they, they're they kind of weird. <gasps> you can get in here. I'm going to take this key. It doesn't like having keys. Note says she loathes me, she loathes me not. Nice, healthy relationship. Looks like he hung out <laughs> there for too long, all. 
Poor kitty. Uh, line one power control system. All systems operating correctly. Okay, that probably means that in the other world, our normal world, maybe it's not correct. It's full of pictures of you playing a game where a tiny pixel man l looks into a trash can at pictures of you. That's fun. Let's go poop. Looking good, Frankie. I think you've let yourself go. Oh, my reflection. Burn. Shut up, reflection. Wait, what? <laughs> no, shut. Oh, our snarls, bangs on doors. Okay. Where was the plunger? I found it before. Hmm. Place looks familiar. Either that's a clue or there's one lazy artist hanging around here. Hmm. The water goes both clockwise and counterclockwise here. Okay. You? Hmm. All right. We we did something. Flicky light. No. Hmm. Maybe we'll go back to the other world. This key. No, oh, mommy. What's that you have there? It's. It smells of evidence to me, but shall not take it beyond this place. Looks like I'll have to put this key back until I find some other way to get it past him. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. I, 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 I got it. Oh, 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 accidentally grabbed the window. It moved it. I think, I think things are okay. Okay. I, I got, I got... No, it's not this one. I think it's the other one. Because this one has the monster, right? It'll be this one? It's the key in the toilet? I can't drop it in there. It seems to be bunged up with something. Oh. It seems to be something stuck in there. That's better. Uh, thanks. I mean, flush. <gasps> we gotta plunge your head. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The ultimate accessory in toilet debungerify. Bungerification. Alright, can we put the key in here now? feel like I should investigate this toilet for the refurbished keys. Fine, let's plunge it. Get away. Get that away from me. Uh, did you just say flush? No. You definitely did. I'm a detective. I don't miss things like talking toilets. Ah, uh, you got me. I can talk. Big whoop. Just do your business and move on. I ain't breaking no laws, cop. I think we dropped some frames for a second. We seem to be okay now. I'm okay, thanks. A talking toilet, eh? And I thought I had a crappy job. Wow. How many a break? It pays the bills. Does it? Do you have bills? Besides, I got dreams, man. I'm gonna be a star. Uh, dreams? Gonna be a comedian, man. Wanna hear a joke? As long as they're not too crappy. Everyone's a comedian. Thank, forget it, man. Wow. Can we can we do this now? No. Seriously, I want to hear one of your jokes. Okay. Why wouldn't Rex bark? He was a goldfish. Yeah. Back for more. Go on. Why did the guy throw the butter out the window? 
You want to see a butterfly? Yeah. One more. You can stay away, can you? One more. What do you call a donkey with three legs? Uh, a wonky? No, you call it a donkey. This physical disability should have no bearing on how you see it, you monster. Oh. Here's one for you. What's green and sm smelly? Oh, he's coming back to toilet humor with you humans. Can we, can we, can we do this now? Uh, can you flush this to the other side for me? What? You think just because I can talk, I'm magical? Sorry, man. You gotta do that on your own. Can we, can we do it? No. I forgive you, man. Hate to be a party pooper, but I'm bum. I'm here all week. Try to veal. I'm joking, don't try to veal. This is a bathroom, not a fancy restaurant. I'm going now. Don't blame you. Uh, do we have to do it this one? Oh. How do we do this? Uh, can you do it, please? Hmm. Meet plunger. Okay, maybe you have to go back to the other side. Hmm. 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 I feel I'm missing. Now I'm done with this guy. Besides, I have a case to solve. Oh, we got an achievement for that. And we're still gonna try this. It needs a guide. Do I have to put the key back? No, I can't. Hmm. Can I put the key here? No. making progress working on it good keep it up son okay uh, can I just give it to you Dooley we just walk past him what's that you got up there it's okay Back until I find some other way to get past them. Hmm. Wait, stick it in here. We stick it in our plunger. Any updates, detective? Still investigating, Raxa? Uh, nope. He's still do dueling. No one's helping. Anything new? All right, let's go. Oh, busker stuff. Is there anything upstairs? Can I put a key? Nothing new. Hmm. I don't know what I want these outfits, but I can't just take them. 
And I keep on clicking on the wrong thing. Sheena's crying. He's very sad. It's definitely looking at me glaring, I'd say. I think it's... I angered it the last time I took a piece. Hmm. Can we anger it with a plunger? Hmm. How, how do I do this? <sighs> Unknown thing. Flush. Hmm. That won't, it, it, it won't work, right? Where's the rat in the other dimension? I just can't, I need to leave my key here or something. Someday you'll be mine, little key. Oh yes, you'll be mine. Okay, we left it. Okay, I didn't seem to be able to do that last time. We got this. Now we can just go. Get out here. Hello, train people. Uh, platform. Still locked. Can you help me? No. Okay. No. Well. Plunger. It was in. It was in the middle. Room. Plunger. Right, you little sucker. Yeah, sucker. Tentacles. Very good. Uh. I should be helping, shouldn't I? Plush. All right. I wonder where that wee fellow is now. <laughs> I do. I do it new. We still got our plunger though. Eh. No. Can I offer you a plunger? No. All right. Let's go back to the other side. Don't mind us. I got this. And we're gonna go there. We're gonna take our key. Yeah. And we're going to, uh... You? There you go. There's my little wiggly buddy. So this is where I sent you. I'm gonna give you a key. Hold on to this, will you, little buddy? In you go. When I plunge you, Dave, remember that I plunge you with love. Oh. Bye. We're best friends. Okay. We did it. Don't mind me. Uh, do we have anything else to say? No. You retrain. Alright. So now we should be able to get the key. Oh, what do you have to say about being in here? Heard of sewer gators, but sewer cephalopods will go down a treat on my conspiracy blog. You have a conspiracy blog? Yeah. Dually Luminati com. I write about important stuff like the world, lizards, crop dusting, and how the moon is fake. 
Wait, the moon is fake? Oh, yeah. Not only did they not land there, but there doesn't seem... <laughs> there doesn't even exist. Who would lie about that and why? The moon people from the real moon behind the fake one. Hmm. Why don't you write more about the stuff we see? Sure, who'd care about a boring old train when there are moon people filling our heads with lies? That's true. Give me give me your stuff. Hmm. Did you name the tentacle Dave? Don't be jealous, Dooley. You're still my favorite. Yay, yeah, yeah, yeah. no cough one second. There we go. Coughed and came back. Okay, we got we got our key. We got our toilet key. From another world. That happens. And we're gonna use it to unlock this room. That seems to have worked. Let's see what's behind door number two. Oh, this looks like an issue. Engineer Tam. What? How'd you get in? Tam locked that door from the inside. Oh, this is your handiwork, I take it? I shouldn't have fired old Tam for sleeping on the job. Told him he did. His black magic classes started at midnight and ran through. Morning shifts eight for old Tam. Heavy sleeper he is. Book him, Dooley. Uh, I, I left my book at the station. Can you use these handcuffs instead? Eh. Yay, we did it. Hey, Dooley. Detective? Yes? Have we tried turning it off and back on again? Which, the computer? I was gonna say the train station, but what you said makes more sense. Oh, there's a cat. Get over there, guy. Seeing what happens <laughs> happens if you hang on for too long. Aw. It's true. What are you talking about? I've seen things duly. Yeah, we've seen the, the cat who doesn't leave. <gasps> Ritual stuff. Looks like this place is a scene of some occultish going on. Occultic going ons? Cinnamon candles remind me of Christmas, though, which is nice. Old Tam always was fond of Christmas. Pappy used to buy us all trains, and Mama gave us voodoo dolls. Magical times of the year. Hey, ritual stuff. Let's look at this computer. Yeah, that's that's gonna cause you some issues. <gasps> Little sushi. Hey. We 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 did solve the toilet tentacle. It's good to see you. Yeah, we have problems problems with a, a train from the dark side and a train from the light side getting all mixed up. Usual things. Virus detected. Uh, line one power control system. Hmm, this is some bad hoodoo. M must have installed an occult virus on the controls. That's causing all these problems. Can we eject the disc? An old floppy disk popped out. This must be how the virus was installed. Could prove useful. How do we... How do we... Escape? Yo, yo, yo. How... How you doing? It's good to see you. This is Engineer Tam. He's causing trouble. Tell me about this. Tam ain't never gonna tell you how to fix that. It's his legacy. Wow, Tam. People will think twice about firing old Tam now. But they'll think twice about hiring you too. Wait, what? Yeah. yeah. Do bad stuff to you. Hmm. Okay, what if we inst Okay, well... Stay here, Julie, and make sure this guy doesn't get away. But then how is Tam meant to escape? That, that's the point. Ah, oh, well, that ain't fair. Sweet potato. <gasps> that sounds great. That sounds like potato, but it's also sweet. It's like that song Sweet Caroline, but with potato. And, you know, different. Okay. Can you help us? 
Uh, no, apparently not. So, I'm thinking since the things work opposite in like the other world, that a, a disc with like cursed things would work really nicely on the other side. Maybe? What do you guys think? Hey, detective, or agent McScream. No, oh, you got no new dialogue. Aww. Yay, Neil Diamond. Oh, she's got a computer. She knows computers. <laughs> if it's like TV or anything, there's only one person who knows how to use a computer. Any updates, detective? Oh, never mind. Uh, Raxa, think you can make any sense of this? Let me see. We're gonna put a demon disc on her computer. That's that's not good. Oh, this is an occult virus. Yeah, I think it's to blame for all that's going on. I can probably talk you through how to make an antivirus on my machine. That's what I was hoping for. Thanks. Uh-oh. Nightbot. You gonna help us, Nightbot? Or are you... Or are you an occult virus? <laughs> so what do I do now? You need to clear up the infected disc sectors. Sounds easy. Not as easy. Not so easy. It's a virus, so each sector you clean will infect those around it. You can also lure the virus from infected sectors to clean ones. Cleaning infected areas. What? Why would I do that? To beat the virus, you have to make sure it has nowhere to hide. That will involve tricking it. This sounds harder than I was expecting. Don't worry. I made a backup. Just hit reset if you need me to roll back so you can start again. Thanks. Okay, let's do this. Uh, what am I doing? This is us. What happens if we go there? Oh. Oh, this is gonna be a thing, isn't it? Uh. There. That's so close. Uh-oh. I need to... I was so close. Okay. I think that was right. No. Hmm. I can I can do this. Maybe. Let's try it again. Okay, we hit this, and then all of these will turn clean. We hit this, all of these will turn clean, except for this one. We hit this. These will be clean. These will be clean. I feel this is like a grade school puzzle. Oh! I did that again. Eventually I'm just gonna click and it'll work out. Oh! No. No. It seemed to be mostly good. Nightbot is on the case. I wish Nightbot was on this case. Eh. Eh. I can't get the last one. I'm dooming the human race. Eh, 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 eh. I'm just gonna click. 
until it works out. Okay. That's a lot now. Damn. It seems to be the best I can do. This is where we lose the game. Hmm. Hmm. I need help. Can you help me? I need to take a moment. That's fine, detective. Oh, I guess we have to try it again. Blah, 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 blah. I think it, is that where I left it off? That will make that one. Oh. I don't. It's always good to have one, right? Hmm. I can make them all red. <laughs> that that didn't go well. Okay, this is basically where we start it. So we do this, this one, this one, this one will turn. We do this one, this one, this one, this one will turn. Do this one, this one, this one, this one will turn. This one, this one, this one. Hmm. This one, this one, this one, this one. Mm. This one, this one, this one, this one. I don't, I don't, I don't think I'm gonna get this. This is, oh, the world is just... The world is doomed. <laughs> hmm. This looks good. It should be enough. <laughs> I'm sure it's it's just it's just me in particular. I don't I don't get it. Like I I would feel you just have to leave one alive. Oh, oh, wait, 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 did we do it? Oh my god, I don't know, that, I, I meant to do that. That, that, that's, first try. Okay, I think that's it. Okay, great. And you're sure this will work? Sure is a strong word when dabbling with the call, but I think so, yes. <laughs> well, if it does, the city owes you big time. Really? Because... I'm only in this train due to a mountain of parking tickets. Hmm. Antivirus disc. Oh, we can't go back out to the ghost world anymore. Well, that sucks. Goodbye. Don't mind me. I know. 
I, I was surprised I was able to do it. Hey, Dooley, anything new? Detective? Yes? Have you tried? Oh, he, he already told us. us. Alright. Thanks to Roxa, this outdated disc should now undo technomancy mischief. Ooh. Uploading antivirus now. Yeah, we did it. Take that, ghost train. Take that, train of the living. Great work, detective. You got the train moving again. Julie, you understand what just happened here, right? No? Man. Let's get this guy to his to the cells. Ah! How are you gonna get me there? Trains ain't running. Well, we just we just talked about how this was fixed. Weren't you listening? Meh. Plus, we have this car. This is not a good day for Tam. Poor Tam. Case closed. We did it. Wow. We did it. <laughs> Edit. He needed a lift because a spooky train was on the tracks. He did not, did not call me about the spooky train, mind you. We did it. We, we did a case. Yeah. I guess we'll do another one? Because it's 11.30, so I've... I don't want to end stream. So we'll go for the police farce. Okay, summary. This is my day away from case to catch up on paperwork. Yeah, one more. This is New Year's. We got a stream. Aw. I mean, it's, it's very important. I want you to see the cases all the way, just in case you have to deal with the occult tomorrow. Uh, you ready, detective? Huh? For McNuggets Retirement Party. The caterer has arrived with the cake. Grab your gift and let's go. Gift? I thought you'd forget. Don't worry, I put your name on my gift. It's from us. Aw, Officer Dooley loves us. Look at how we stare at each other. But, you know, inter-office romances are frowned upon. Doesn't mean we can't love each other, though. Uh, what's going on? Hurry up, cake. I want to use my computer. This computer has been with me since the beginning. Budget won't allow for an upgrade. I feel that. I have that issue at work. Uh, notes from open cases. Downtown Ghoulie Man. Possibly undead flasher. Ooh. Mirror Jane. A woman appearing in the mirrors to other women who look exactly like her. That's awesome. Lynch Toupee. A wig made from a werewolf hair, which turns others into werewolves when worn. Maybe that should be werewolves. Get it? Werewolves. This is my life now. Radio. Aw, I'm, I'm glad you're here. I, I know the whole Christmas season is probably very, very busy for you. I'm, I'm glad you survived it. Ooh, Dick Brickman, that's an awesome name. If I wasn't ten year old ten years old, I in giggling. Uh this is Twin Lakes FM featuring me, Dick Brickman, bringing you Dick Brickman's presents the weather with me, Dick Brickman. Wow. How many times can I say that in one sentence or sentence? It's raining. Tune in later for me, Dick Brickman's presenting Dick Brickman's tricky kicks. Featuring me, Dick Brickman. Alright. There's a globe. 
when all this dark side stuff is put to bed, I'm gonna see the whole world. Oh, that's so sweet. Actually, I don't know what's in these. The keys were lost before this became my office. Coat. My trusty coat goes everywhere from... Goes with everything from shirt to tie to sportswear. My folders of weird going-ons in Twins Lakes. In various attempts to file reports for the things I've seen. I guess we're gonna we're just gonna go. Ooh, look at this coffee machine. Oh, look, busted ceiling fan. That's gonna kill us. <laughs> Why is this broken? Maybe the motor is bust. I'll have to look at it this later. This doesn't seem to be my job to fix the ceiling fan. Nothing beats the first cup of coffee. If only I had a slice of pie to go with it. Awesome, we got coffee. Java Sweet Joe, Black Oil, Uncle Moo Moo's Morning Surprise, the Liquid Viper Coffee. We, you already said that. We can get some water. Glass of cold, refreshing. Nope. This is warm, oddly colored. <laughs> I don't remember this place being so run down. What's going on, Julie? You think I'll have my own office someday? I hope so, buddy. I hope so. Uh, Mc Oh, we're McQueen. And then there's McKing's office. Hello, Mr. Oh, McKing is doing really well for themselves. Best hair on the force. Wow. Okay, I'll give him that. Yeah, the, is that him? This one looks homemade. Best of not being McQueen. McKean, McQueen won this for being the best diver on the force. I don't recall anyone else being allowed to partake. We just took his trophy. Okay. Uh, he's got a fancy computer. This machine has an off button. Impressive. Port's back. Fancy. It's full of signed pictures of McKing. Figures. Pottery wheel. There's space in here for a pottery wheel? That's, they're so messy. Pottery wheels are very messy. Just heads up if you want one in your home. McKean, McKean, I can talk. I need hydration. Let's get some water. There we go. McKing and Chief. I guess these are the photos you get when you're married to the mayor. Aww. Look at them. They're so sweet. Let's go. There's other humans. Uh. No talk working. Friendly as ever. What? Wazowski? Go away. Computer screen. It seems. Murakami? Has it set a new high score in whatever he's playing? Damn it, how am I meant to get better than him if you keep making me work? Tell me that, eh? Fire extinguisher. Pressure seems gone. I should fix it before, before it's needed. We're just grabbing random crap everywhere. Headphone wires. Okay, we took some headphone wires. Uh, can we... Okay, never mind. Stairwell, the briefing room. Oh! <laughs> fire? <laughs> you meant to say surprise, detective, not fire. Julie, the gifts are on fire. They sure are impressive. Um... <laughs> the gifts are on fire. No one seems to care. Damn drunken cops. Nope. 
I need to repressurize it first. How do you pressurize that fire extinguisher? Um, cake? I'm gonna devour that thing. Eh, oh, it's Chief Scully. Hey, Scully. Hands off, officer. We're not cutting into it yet. But Chief, really? The cake is... Is the cake really more important than the fire? Actually, who brought fire? We discussed this last time. No more gifts on fire. Uh, fire. God damn it, cops. Thinking they're Prometheus. That, that's so true. Uh, I love all the booze we have at these things. What about the fire? Keep your complaint to yourself, Killjoy. McNugget. Two days left to retirement. I'm in a room with an uncontrolled fire. Just the old gypsy, just like the old gypsy woman said. Um, hey Julie. Party's on fire. Sprinklers. Why are the sprinklers broken? What's going on here? We use the same banner for every retirement. Budgets have to be cut somewhere, detective. Do slash budgets explain why the sprinkler system isn't putting out the fire? That's interesting. Why don't you go do some detective? Detecting detective? Alright. Can we... No. Oh, well, that seemed like a good idea. Fan motor. You want, do you want some coffee? Oh, never mind. So we'll just we'll just go. The building's on fire, no worries. Oh. Never mind. Um okay. I'm a trophy with fire extinguisher. I don't know what you want me to do, game. Is there anything else? Apparently we have to deal with the fire. And a whipped cream. Oh, okay, okay. You use the whipped cream to... Hey, I want an extra whip, extra cream in my slice. Okay, we should use the whipped cream with the fire extinguisher? I can say 100% I can 100% say this is not something expected to do today. Okay, we fix the fire extinguisher by. Yep, that makes sense. Whoosh! <laughs> well, that's that taken care of. Wait, what's that? That urn. You mean our gift? Julie, where'd you get that? In that mysterious Chinese shop we visited last week? Investigate it. We investigate it for gremlins. That seems like racial profiling to me. Julie. He clearly has had gremlins. Which you then bought and brought to the station. Well then, case closed. Julie, the lid was burnt off. Gremlins are missing. And the station is crumbling apart. Like I said, case, case closed. Julie, we seem to be a buzzkill. We're making work. Julie, we need to find them before someone gets hurt. Here, take this. But the cake. Julie receives item gremlin earned. Okay. From what I can see, no one else got him anything nice anyway. Pick up menu. In fact, I've seen nothing work related here at all. It's a party, guy. Relax. Uh, here's the donut and coffee rotation. Important stuff. Detective? Um, didn't you see this fire chief? Of course, it, it was right there. And you didn't do anything? What can I do? People want to re-gift the fires I got them last month. 
then let them. Wait, you were the ones who you were the one who set those fires around the station last month. They were beacons of hope, all very metaphorical. They were real fires. Metaphors can be very real. The chief makes a, a lot of sense. And what if you wanted to tell Gondor, you know, the beacons were lit? Um... Why is my king's office so much nicer than mine? That seems petty. You think our barely legal goblin and ghouls division should have a bigger office than the mayor's husband? Just be glad you're not down in the basement. Uh, thanks for supporting the dark side division, chief. Don't thank me. Just keep the city clean of those oogie boogie men. And those oogie boogie women. Yep. Equal. And those non binary binary oogie boogies. Yeah, let's... No discrimination regarding the Oogie Boogies. Yes. Let's love all the Oogie Boogies. Um, except for the discrimination of keeping them out of Twin Lakes. Apart from that one, yes. We discriminate equally. We discriminate against all Oogie Boogies equally. Um, I think there may be a gremlin loose in the station. Seriously... We just talked about this. You have one job, one job. No oogie boogies in Twin Lakes. This station is t in Twin Lakes. Get this situation under control, detective. On it, chief. All right. No party for you two until this mess is cleaned up. Get to it. Aw. Let's just grab a cake. Hands off, officer. Oh, yeah, we already, we already read that. Let's go. Let's get these oogie boogies. Uh, stairwell? Hey, it's McKing. And he said, that's my kid's candy, give it back. So I told him I was the mayor's husband. I showed him my badge, fined him for obstructing, obstruction of justice. Oh, you're so bad. I don't know where that voice went from. It's Dallas. Hey, Dallas. It must be so great for you to have a real detective like McKing around to learn from. Yeah. Look at him. He looks pretty good. He's like Magnum P.I. But, yo, a police officer, not a P.I. I don't have time, time to talk to you. Isn't there a Wookiee or something you should be arresting? That's not what... Whatever, McLean. Live long and prosper, dork. Wow. Evidence room. Hands off, McLean. Something's broken the evidence door. Probably you and your idiot sidekick's fault. I'm gonna fix it with my manly skills and muscles. If you really want to help, you can fetch me some more coffee. No need for sugar. Dallas is enough sweetness for me. Aw, oh, that's so sweet. You're so bad. I hate this man. But he's so dreamy. He is pretty dreamy. You can be an asshole if you're this dreamy. That's that's the line. Here. Have some coffee. You were good for something, McLean. Um, can we go in now? I got you coffee. Okay. I got you coffee. Let's go to the bathroom. That bathroom, so horrible. People only enter for the most dire of emergencies. Oh, I guess not. Garage, shooting range, reception. <gasps> Look at this, Officer Cal. Officer Cal. He was meant to be a sniffer dog, but someone decided to train him only to sniff out candy. But think of all the candy-related crimes he's been able to help solve. True, we did have an alarmingly, alarmingly high rate of candy smuggling in Twin Lakes. Good job, officer. First aid. 
We got some laxatives, maybe? Someone put him in there it's just as cops are full of shit. Who in Lakes Police Department? How can I direct your call? Ooh, we got some laxatives. Now that I don't need it, I find a working fire ext working extinguisher. Oh. Can we give you a laxative? No. What do you want, detective? Can't you see I'm... I have a reception desk to recept that? Uh, paperwork. Okay. Sorry. He's talking about lunch and his paperwork. Hey, Julie. Thanks was my mentor when I joined the force. That's why they bust me down to desktop. <laughs> desktop. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Okay. Stairwell, holding cell. Holding cell one. Uh, there's a rat. This guy's in police protection for inform in for informing. So we put that up to cover up the hole a prisoner dug to escape. Sadly for him, he dug his way into the rest of the station. Probably not toilet urine carcinate incarcerations get you down? Oh wow. That's that's awful awful. Oh, hey, Roy. Detective? I'm gonna use my detectiving skills and say you're in for a solicitation? He, oh, he's the, he's from the first case. He was the, the father of the missing girl. Impressive. Uh, your guess, not as soliciting. All right, anyways. Hand them over, Roy. And whatever. Your matches and cigars. I wish I'd never met you, detective. Yay, we got... Let's go set them on fire. Never mind. He is 18 pixels of pure dreamy. That's all you need, really. Fire hose. A hose they use to loop through the cell door. Handle to lock the place up at night. Oh. Chief Scully really pulled this place into a sort of order, didn't she? Okay, we got a hose. We got so much stuff going on. Can we combine these? Oh, we have a dri diving helmet. With a fan motor. Nope. With laxatives? Well, let's see what we got. Oh! It's Tam. Hey, Tam. Old Tam loves to whittle. Whittle, whittle, whittle. Tam, you can't have a knife in prison. Tam can, Tam has. Afraid I'm gonna have to confiscate that. Tam does not have warmth for you in his heart. Oh, I feel really bad now. Old Tam ain't got nothing to do no more. Prison is a punish punishing place. Give him back his knife. Pam. Pam puts his name in places so he knows what is and what's not. Alright. We got a knife. Nope. Hmm. We got lots of stuff going on. Too much stuff. Dispatch? Oh! That seems to be a gremlin. Yummy, yummy wires. I'm trying to hack the database. Steal all the human info. We should fry him, detective. Interesting idea. Let's stab him. Oh. Um, dispatcher? Can't not talk now, detective. The system's broken. I can't figure out why. Oh, right. I don't know about how all this works, but I know it's not right. Got a whiteboard. This is the first bit of actual police work I've seen in this place. 
Oh. I used to work in dispatch until I dispatched entire force to the chief's house trying to order myself some late night pizza. Can you get them? Uh, can we give him a laxative? <laughs> Alright, can we do something about this? The servers for the TLP. Ha by ha. Ouch! Don't get too close, detective. That thing is a biter. He just. I just got. Yeah, thanks, Julie. Thumbs up. Set you on fire. Anything I can drawers. Rubbish. Oh. We got a bobby pin? Okay, we got a bobby pin. Can we use that with the fan motor? Think you can pry the shell off? Yeah. We got a magnet. Why? Why? Magnet and the knife. No. Can we get this mug? A bug? Normal run in the bill mug. I don't know why I feel the need to comment on every item in the room. Um. Okay, well we found the gremlin. I don't seem to be able to do anything about it, though. Like, we can't stab him. What does Julie say? Julie says to fry him, right? So can we set him on fire? I feel we need to electrocute him, maybe? downstairs shooting range oh that's not good how did they get a gun why is everything so unsafe in the station pew pew hee 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 uh use my magnus to take attract the bullets hit out with a knife that's all i know what to do give it laxative so it will poop Set it on fire. Looks like our guys are good enough shots to be stormtroopers. Junction box, that seems to be important. Sprinklers? Okay, it says we need to fix them. Let's do that. Air vent. There's a serious draft coming from those air, from those vents. The bolt is probably just needs to be tightened up. Okay. Use a knife. Can we use a magnet? Oh. Nope. He's got a nice car. Look at McKing's car. Bulletproof sports car. This is our squad car. A government issued block with wheels. Junction box. Hmm. Dispatch junction box is screwed cl closed. Use our. N n <laughs> Have you ever tried to, I don't know, open something with like just a screw using a screwdriver? <laughs> I've always been more of a lateral thinker. Yeah, don't <laughs> don't open an electrical panel with a knife. That just seems like a bad idea. Hmm. Now I just need to find something to rewire this with. Well, we got wires. Okay, let's see. I don't know why I'm wiring. I need to drag the wires from one nod to the other. Same color nod without crossing them. Oh. Okay. This can go here. And... This will... Nope. Huh. It 
this will go something like uh, let's, let's undo that now we have to puzzle again That's not gonna work. Because we need. No, that's not gonna work at all. Okay. But that not won't work. Am I overthinking? I could be. Let's try not to over let's try not overthinking and see how that works. Yeah, I was overthinking that. I was totally overthinking that. Oh, we just killed this gremlin. We are terrible people. We murdered. It's okay. Bye, Spike. Eek! The cat. Yes, the system's back online. Time to do some hardcore cop work. All right. We did that. Construction site. What's what's going on here? Hey, buddy. You don't look very busy. Power tools busted, so Union says I don't work. Not my place to go against Union. You seem familiar. Do I know you? Not that I know of. No. Gary Plinkman. Can I take your tools? Might never borrow this. Why not? Can't see me getting back to work anytime soon. Okay, we got a monkey wrench. What's what's broken? Book. Oh, this er, uh, this is not really just the book I got from the library. <laughs> Late fees. Ooh. Proper steamy stuff. This. Julie, is that? Is that you on the cover? In a Fabio wig? I, uh, those critters ain't gonna catch themselves, are they, detective? Julie. This is what happens when I can't talk my way out of stuff. Late fees? There are monsters to catch, detective. Oh, Julie's ripped. Yay, Julie. We support you. Water valves. Let's get this water flowing again in case another fire starts. Oh my gosh. The water pipe runs all over the station from the briefing room to the shooting range. The system seems broken right now. It's probably Gremlin's fault. Okay, we got we got some classic gaming. Uh, what is it called? Pipe dreams? There we go. Easy peasy. In the <laughs> in the arcade version of the games, the water starts flowing, so you have to do it quickly. The splinter should be working now. E have me out of work, you will. Okay. Valve piping. The spare pipes from work that's happening. Pot of clay. Oh. Lump of coal, hard clay. I have no use for it right now. Okay. Are you still not busy? Dinner is ready. Yay, dinner. Happy dinner. It's yummy. I will try to stop the gremlins. This should work now, right? No. Oh. Some more coffee. Oh. Oh, I know what to do. I know what to do. We're gonna get him some more coffee. We're gonna get him some coffee and we're gonna put laxatives in his coffee because we're an asshole. 
let's do this. Yeah. He's gonna poop himself in front of in front of Dallas, I think her name is. Let's keep this coffee coming, make a lame. Could drink this stuff all day. Oh no, no, get out of my way. He's pooping. He's pooping. You wanna go visit my insides, make it stop. Hey Dallas. Hope he's okay. The people of Twin Lakes need a hero to look up to. Even heroes poop sometimes. Now to fix this with my manly skills and muscles. But mostly by finding a way to cheat the magnet magnetic lock. Oh. We have a magnet. This magnet should reverse the polarity and let me in. Really? <gasps> it's a gremlin. Chomp chomp claw face. Too dangerous to get near. I need to find a way to knock it out. Oh. <laughs> I don't know. That was my thing. Hit it with a wrench. <gasps> magical tome. I hope this illegal magical tome will be okay. We're here... When the door is busted. Uh, wizard hat, skull, other books. Role play books. Wizard's hat. All that remains of the mysterious walking luggage that ate everything in case. Plastic skull. A surprisingly more dangerous occult items than a real skull. Evidence. Gas grenades. This could be handy if I want to be able to leave the party early. Ooh, can we can we gas grenade you? That would knock me and Dooley out too. Oh, oh, there we go. Dooley, take take this hose outside and keep the fresh air coming. Gas grenade. Take this, you little monster. Oh no! We gassed a gum gremlin. He's dead. But why do we want to go over here? Can we get some more? No. Oh. While it's unconscious, I'll stuff it into my seemingly magical pockets. Uh, okay. Okay. That makes sense. I'm taking this helmet off before I go out there. No need to walk around the station raising suspicious suspicions or being made fun of by everyone in the precinct. Alright. Tuning range. No reception. Was it dispatch? Yeah, this dispatch has this one. It passed out. Let's go. <laughs> Let's get it out of here. Yay! Can we do something with the server? Hmm. Okay, she's busy. We got two gremlins. So we need to... We need to get this one. Oh, oh, wait. The sprinklers, sprinklers working now, right? More matches from Busty Bells. So we use this. This should achieve something. We did it. The creature's uh, wet. Don't know why I expected more from that. Yeah, I don't know either. Um. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Can we throw this? No. Well, he's wet now. That's gonna electrify the floor. Bullet hole. Keeps hitting that spot while shooting at us. We need something stronger to hide behind. Hmm. 
Achoo! Maybe we wait long enough, it'll catch a cold. Maybe. Junction box. I feel we can electrocute if we wanted to. Somehow. Um... Was it the garage? Okay, we, apparently we don't need to tinker with it anymore. Oh, wait, wait. Monkey wrench? Gremlins have broken everything else around here. I'm sure if I didn't remove this now, it would fall off sooner. Soon anyway. Neither of us believe that, but I'm so into this. Fight the system. Julie, we are, <laughs> we are part of the system. Speak for yourself. I'm bringing this place down from the inside. Kind of knew that. Oh! Did not expect that to happen. Feel bad about it? No. Okay, it, um... Let's say the vent broke because some maverick cop was crawling around through it. But the, the car is bulletproof, so we'll take this hood? I think this is for my trophy cabinet. I mean, I'll take it to be repaired. Yeah, that second one. Detective, how do you get all those things into your pocket? Origami. Can we go up here? Okay, well, I think we got this. Shooting range. I'll just have to angle it like this. Oh! That was a shocking way to wrap this up. Oh, that sound is lovely. Are you proud of that pun? Or than I should be. Just leave. Then go back. Never mind. Finally, Julie, grab the gun and I'll take this guy. Isn't it still elect it's like, isn't electricity still going? Okay, let's go back to the office before someone sees us. Okay, let's lock these suckers in their new urn and get back to that party. Party! Uh, here you go. In you go, sleepy monster. Back to captivity, my monstrous pal. Welcome home, little... Oh. Oops. Oops. Is that it? What do we do now? Flush him down the toilet and go back to the party? That was my thought. We need to make a new urn, a magical one, that can actually hold them. Again, we got gremlins. Okay. Can we... McKean's office. Can they go in there? Hmm. Pottery wheel. Okay, okay, okay. We found, um, clay somewhere. Where was it? Was it in the garage? The construction site? Yeah. Hot of clay. This is good urn making material. Piping? Oh, okay. Do we need more? Do we need water? Can we get some water? Do you want another coffee? No. Nope. Okay, there's clay on the pottery wheel. It's too dry to use, of course it is. Oh, we can just use it in the water. Okay, let's soften that up. Yeah, wet clay. All right, pottery wheel. Let's do this. How do you know how to make an urn? I watch that film Ghost a lot. For research. It's okay to watch that movie, it's a good movie. All right, we got an urn. Oh, right, right, right. Okay, the urn needs to be magical. There's magical things in the evidence room. Just somewhere? 
Oh, here it is. Magical tome. Maybe there'll be instructions here for sealing magical urns? Let's see. Warding ritual. Spells to bypass, doing the dishes, and aha, a diagram of how to seal magical urns. Handy. Time for some finger crafting of runes. Okay, we got magical urn. Can we do this now? One down. Okay, these glyphs carve in to be able to hold the gremlins. Oh, was I skipping? That's two. That's three, we're done, thank goodness. Let's get this somewhere safe. <laughs> we were already here. Okay, lock fixed, gremlins stashed away. What have we learned from this duly? Uh, not to eat so much sugar. I'm crashing now. I don't really remember much of what what happened. I'm sure there was nothing important. Meh. Let's get back to the party. We did it. Hey, where's the, all the cake gone? We ate it all. Why is this place a mess? What did you two do? Well, there was... And uh, we, someone let off a ga gas grenade. <laughs> Nasty big pointy teeth. Car was smashed when we got there. Meh. The king did it. Uh, another one, another one to file under dark side antics. Probably for the best, yes. Okay, well, you two better start cleaning. The budget doesn't allow for both of your capers and custodian staff. Oh man, chores and no cake. This day did not play out the way I hoped. There's probably some lesson about that. Magical toilet urn. That's what I would use. We did it! Paperwork got left behind as Dooley let some gremlins loose in the station. Rounded it up, rounded them up, but lost out on cake as a result. It's it's pretty sad. But that'll do it for us tonight. We got two two cases to go. This is uh, uh, I'm not gonna quit because this seems to be the type of game that would like boot you out as soon as you you know say quit. But yeah, that'll probably do it for me tonight. First stream of the year, yay! And yeah, thanks for hanging out. Um, yeah, gotta thank everyone. Gotta thank the chatters. Thank you, chatters. Uh, gotta thank the lurkers. Lurkers are love. And to the vod watchers from the future. I hope the future is bright. 